All right, we are taking a peek at some more crossout today, and we are doing another pack review. And today we are looking at the Born to Fly pack. Uh, this one's 1999, and what kind of toys do you get with this one? Well, let's start out with the important stuff. Um, you get a thousand coins. So let's do a little bit of math. What's that? Let's go teacher mode here. One thousand divided by 1999. Boom. So just yeah, obviously about 50, 50 coins per dollar here on this one. So as for value, it's okay, but is it the best value uh, per coin? Eh, maybe not. It depends on how much you could sell some of these parts for. So you get this thing, uh, the Iron Talon here in the Born to Fly pack, and right away, yeah, it's not great. Um, you, you get uh, an auto cannon. you get a Wyvern cab, okay. Um, some things you do get that are cool, you get this vanity exhaust, which I did not have, and it looks like we get four uh, racing tires, which I also didn't have, but the real biggie in this one is right here. Ooh. Get back here. Where did you go? No, I didn't say disappear. Get back here. <laughs> the real biggie in this one is the motor, aircraft engine. Now, this thing is uh, pretty decent. It gives you... Uh, 3,000 more kg. Engine speed is okay. Power is ridiculous, but it also has module reload speed increased by 20%. Uh, and somehow it actually it nets you a reputation bonus. No, that's just our vehicle overall. I'm just being silly. So let's get rid of all the parts here. Yes, disassemble it, and let's let's compare some of them. So if we were looking at engines, the aircraft engine has a power score of 470 where the improved engine uh, only has a power score of 235 and it requires one less energy so I've been really enjoying the improved engine on most of my builds but if you needed some more mass limits and uh, you're running some kind of module uh, you're definitely going to want to go with the aircraft engine it's it's the, the best thing you're going to get out of this pack other than that you get, I get another wyvern cab which eh, we can sell that off looks like we get some lightweight frames and let's go take a peek at here we go uh, racing wheels so these are these are highly recommended I've actually never tried them out so let's let's take this thing for a spin I'm gonna build you how fast is this thing gonna go we're obviously not gonna do a lot of killing with this build I mean it's got like no armor let's get some aircraft pieces it's got a car jack probably need in this build as it's gonna flip over like nobody's business I bet but she's fast she's definitely fast and the engine looks awesome although anyone who's doing a proper build you're not gonna leave that anywhere that anyone can see it and then of course you get this ridiculous blue paint um, you see everybody running so now I know which pack all of those guys bought Okay, so with the uh, Born to Fly pack, what do we get for new vanity parts? We get hell pipes, which I kind of admit that I, I want those. We get a round brake light. We get this goofy, spiky outer fender thing. And that's it. These other ones are from uh, Midgar pack here, so ignore those. All right, should we take this thing to battle just once? Okay. Why not? Just for kicks. This will be stupid, but we're gonna we're gonna battle with it anyway. All right, this is a terrible build, but we're gonna we're gonna try it out anyway, just for kicks. Like, look at us, look at me going full noob here. Oh, we got baddies already coming to base here. Like one measly little auto cannon. So we be. Oh, and overheat so fast with no coolers. We've been cannoned. already overheated. Oh, the brake lights do do work. Look at that, you hit the brakes. They light up. That's cool. As for combat though, this build is terrible. Yeah, I can't. I can drive circles around this guy. Wheel on the spot. So far now. At least maybe you can have to stay alive by going around the circle. One auto cannon by itself is so bad for full screen like this. I'm like playing it like a vector. Forgive me, and I've overheated. <laughs> it's early. I'm 
do with my coffee right now? I wasn't ready for combat, I just wanted to look at show and make parts of cars here. I said make parts because I was playing like where the other day, getting confused with my game. And we're the only ones left alive over here. What is the team doing? Apparently not capping the encounter objective either. Let's get out of here. Because this thing excels at one thing, and that is raw speed. Yeah, racing tires, lightweight, wyvern cab here, and we have an aircraft engine, which you gotta admit is pretty cool just because of the fact that it is an aircraft engine. Well, I have failed my team. It would appear that my team has also failed. Because this match is nearly over. See this guy's rocking the, the flag here. There's your reputation. I need one of those. Is that like really fast auto cannon thing? I gotta have one. I need one. Well, let's spin cookies stupidly in our new ride until this is over. Until somebody takes this out. These guys are taking far too long to get that done. And we're toast. Alright, guys, recap. The uh, Born to Fly pack, what do you get? It's 1999. You get 1,000 coins, mostly what I needed. Um, some cool vanity pipes, aircraft engine, wyvern cab if you don't have it, racing tires, and uh, auto cannon. Meh. But hey, it's okay. It's one of the cheaper ones, so if you've got a little scratch and your wife will let you blow more money on fake cars on the internet, then you're good to go with this one. All right, guys, that is it for me. If you want to see more of these reviews in the future, give us a sub, throw us a like. I will catch you all later. Mr. G out.